Hi guys, it's Rick Shields down here at Lumina Golf Resort here in Spain. And this is the complete golf swing guide. I'm gonna take you through the whole stage of the golf swing. And this is gonna be valuable for every type of golfer. If you are brand new to the game, perfect. Because it's gonna take you step by step in bite-sized chunks to get you to learn how to swing the golf club. If you're an established player already, even better still, because some of these elements in this series of videos is gonna highlight some of your faults and show you how to fix it in detail. So it's gonna be a series of videos. And this first video is the real summary of what a golf swing is. So how I want to start this complete guide is talk about the golf swing in general, the actual action of the golf swing, because still even established golfers get confused about this element. If you're new to golf, I see a lot of different styles when you're new to golf. And for me, it's, it's always good to start about what the actual movement involves. So the golf swing itself, and this is what I want you to think about when you're actually starting golf. And there's going to be lots of little bite-sized chunks from this. And I'll go through each little finer detail in separate videos. But for me, the golf swing wants to create power, accuracy, and consistency. They're the three elements that we need in a golf swing. That's what's going to help us hit this golf ball with a consistent action that's going to create enough power to get the ball going forward and far. And then we want it to be as consistent as possible. And all these elements I'm going to talk about in these series of videos is going to help. And all these videos are going to be on YouTube, not going to go anywhere else. They'll all be ready for you to see on YouTube. So the golf swing itself, and I'm going to go really quite simple on this as well. The golf swing is a rotational action of the golf club that moves around the body in a circle-like manner. So it, go, it moves around the body in a circle-like manner, mainly powered from your body. But obviously the arms and the way we hold the golf club have an influence, but mainly works around the rotational elements of your shoulders and your hips. And if we can get those movements working together and we focus on that idea that the swing is more rounded, straight away for a lot of golfers, that's going to make a big difference. Certainly if you are brand new to the game. I see a lot of golfers in the brand new up and down action using the arms only. Well, if we're looking for power, we're not going to get that just from the arms only. We need to use the body more. I'm going to talk about hold in a separate video. In fact, if you want to see that straight away, the link up here in the corner of the eye, you can see that straight away. I'm going to talk about setup in a different video as well. But again, that's all going to be in the corner. The swing itself, and I will go into more detail around this, is this idea that it is the roundness of the golf club moving around the body in a circled action as I'm turning my hips and my shoulders. And that is what is key. As the club moves around the body, I'm working my torso, I'm twisting my body around. And then once I've got to that twist, I want to unwind so that the club follows the same angle as it went up. And that is as, as me simplifying it as much as I can. And if I was to do this now action, I'm not going to hit this one hard. And I'll talk about how we stand to the ball later down the line and how we hold it. But the swing moves around the body, mainly powered from the torso turning and then unwinding. So the torso rotates and then unwinds. I'm a little bit too close to this flag, to be fair, for hitting the club that I'm hitting, but I'm just showing you the elements. So again, I'll do that one more time. The club's moving around the body as I'm turning my torso, I'm twisting my body. And then unwinding so that the golf club comes down on the same angle as best we can, as best we can. Only when the arms start to get interfered within the arm start to try and do something differently, does the club not come down on the same angle? And that's where I want to start this complete golf guide. The idea that the swing is a rounded action and how we determine that rounded action will come in a later video when I talk about setup and also a little bit more detail about the backswing. But you've got to think if you're starting golf in the first ever instance, this is the first ever time you're going to go and play golf or go down to the driving range or just have a casual round of golf with your mates what i want you to think about is it's not up and down as if you're chopping the golf ball 
that the action is a rounded action by turning the body and then unwinding the body to allow that golf club to work at an angle around the body. When we talk about direction next, we're going to talk about grip. That will be coming in the next video. You can click the link up in the corner to go to that straight away. I'm also going to talk about setup, a little bit more detail on the backswing, coming into impact, and then the follow through. I'm going to bite size all of those elements. But I wanted to do almost just an overview first of the golf swing, just to start us off, just to get us thinking about the right ideas.